بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم My name is Asad Yaqub and once again here I am with report writing, IELTS writing task 1. I already made a lot of videos but still there should be more. That's what you guys are demanding and that's why I'm making more videos for you. This time I'm going to present a framework for writing about processes and changes. We are going to see how to write introduction, overview and key features. Uh, some academic task one uh, task types such as maps, diagrams and flowcharts may not use data. They don't have data, okay. You can use the same framework with a few small changes. What sort of changes are there? Now let me tell you if in report writing they give you map, diagram or a flowchart. Now remember in map, diagram and flowchart there is no data. If you have to write on that, how you can write, that's what I'm going to tell you. Introduction. Okay, so paraphrase the question prompt by writing a one to two sentence introduction. Now what is question prompt? The diagram below shows the process by which bricks are manufactured for the building industry. This is what we call question prompt and you have to paraphrase. Paraphrase means you got to write it in your own words. For diagram, you can use the word uh, illustration. Uh, for shows, you can write the word highlights, right? So something like that you can do. In one of my videos, I explained that very well. So you got to do it in one to two sentences. Introduction, uh, one to two sentence introduction. That explains generally what the diagram maps or pictures show. Example, the diagram shows how bricks are made. Now they said, the diagram below shows the process by which bricks are manufactured and we converted that into how bricks are made for the construction industry or the maps show the changes to a hotel in Riyadh between 1990 and 2018. This is how you are going to write introduction. After introduction, you got to write an overview and write a one to two sentence overview that summarizes that uh, the main stages or the main steps or the main changes or processes uh, that are there. Uh, state how many stages or steps or changes or processes there are. Example. The process for manufacturing bricks for the building industry consists of seven consecutive steps. Seven consecutive steps. Or there have been four important changes to the hotel's rooms, facilities and service level. Like this you got to write an overview. Next, select the key features and explain them clearly. You need to select the key features and explain them clearly. Group or categorize the information into logical stages or steps and remember we are learning how to write about processes. Example, the first stage is then after that finally. For this again I recommend you my IELTS report writing vocabulary workshop. You must watch that to learn these phrases. Do not explain your opinion or use your knowledge about the topic that I know more about brick making and I'll explain that, okay? This is a descriptive task. Simply describe the visual. So do not say, I think the reason why the process and all that, never say anything like that. Check your work. When you finish writing, spend a few minutes at the end checking your grammar and spelling carefully. So in proofreading, grammar and spelling and count the number of lines 10 words per line multiplied by 15 to 17 lines so the total words are 150 to 170 if you like this video hit on the like button and don't forget to subscribe my channel i have another channel asad yakub vlogs please subscribe that channel as well and i'll share some more videos on asad yakub vlogs and they will help you with your ielts preparation Apart from this, I teach IELTS online. If you want to join my online IELTS classes, you can contact me for that. Asad Yaqub wishes you all the best from Lahore, Pakistan. Take good care of yourselves. Allah Hafiz.